Hey everyone, and welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to talk about the truth about Andrew Tate's net worth in 2022. Let's get right into it. Over the past few months, Andrew Tate has taken the internet by storm. Internet personality and ex-kickboxer Emery Andrew Tate III went viral in 2022 after clips of some of his controversial opinionated takes began circulating on TikTok. He has also participated in Twitch debates with notable names such as Hassan Hassanabi Piker and Felix XQC Lengyel, with whom he got into a heated argument over his anti-women remarks and claims that females are bad drivers. But who is he? Andrew Tate is a British-American influencer and former kickboxing champion who rose to prominence through hard work, training, and a slew of divisive opinions, mostly about women and society. Andrew Tate also founded Hustlers University, a Discord-based social network where he connects successful hyper-ambitious men and sells training courses on how to make money, get women, and achieve the ultimate male physique. According to Andrew Tate's business page, success is learned. He wrote, I grew up broke and now I'm a multimillionaire. I teach the deserving the secrets to modern wealth creation. In addition to his courses, Andrew Tate owns online webcam studios and casinos as offshoot business endeavors. Andrew Tate recently went viral for his controversial takes and anti-women rants on Aiden Ross's Twitch podcast on the 15th of July, 2022. He's also been quoted stating that women should be treated like Lambos and that females are terrible drivers. In the Andrew Tate vs XQC debate, he referred to his girlfriends as his property and stated that he felt safer if a man drove a car for him rather than a woman. The majority of the debate was a rally of heated, argumentative statements between Andrew Tate and XQC, so it's not surprising that his remarks fell flat. Aside from those rousing opinions, the Andrew Tate vs Hassan Abi debate that followed the initial dumpster fire stream with XQC garnered a lot of attention on July 20th, 2022. Both internet icons were at each other's throats and discussed several interesting topics, including Andrew Tate's online businesses, which Hassan Abi claimed was a scam. Instead of amplifying opinions, Andrew Tate chose to avoid the scandalous remarks Hassan Abi made about the ex-kickboxer, who later stormed out of the podcast. Conversations became heated at the time, with both influencers joking about whether Earth was flat or not, to which Andrew Tate responded that he'd been to space and seen the planet's round surface. Returning to the subject of women, during another Andrew Tate vs XQC debate with Aidan Ross and Kai Sanat, on July 21st, 2022, the ex-kickboxing champion shared his thoughts on whether or not women ruled the world. Tate responded by asking if they thought a girl deserved the world and everything from a guy because she has a p the Twitch stars appeared to agree, which surprised me given their history of rallying disagreements. However, there are numerous other reasons why Andrew Tate has become popular on the internet. Andrew Tate was kicked off Big Brother in 2017 after a video of him beating a woman surfaced online. Furthermore, his tweets about women who have been raped should bear some responsibility also caused another stir of controversy. Andrew Tate fled the United Kingdom and relocated to Romania after being charged with 11 counts of sexual assault. The same year, Andrew Tate was quoted on Twitter saying, it's easier to get away with rape charges in Eastern European countries. He said, it was probably 40% of the reason he moved to Romania. Finally, in the most recent headline-grabbing controversy, Romanian police investigated Andrew Tate in 2022 for human trafficking. The investigation was launched after a woman was reported to being held against her will at Andrew Tate's home. However, Romanian police officials stated that no one has been charged. But before all that, Andrew Tate was a professional kickboxer. Andrew Tate reportedly worked in television advertising prior to kickboxing around 2009. He has, however, been involved in kickboxing and martial arts since 2005. Andrew Tate did not win his first title until 2009 at the International Sport Karate Association, or ISKA. Andrew Tate won his second ISKA Championship and the World Full Contact Light Cruiserweight Championship by split decision in 2013. Since then, Andrew Tate has won 78 matches and only lost 9. Andrew Tate has won 4 kickboxing championships in total. The former kickboxer retired in September 2017 after a Twitter post stated, I've basically retired from professional combat and I have never enjoyed exercise. Andrew Tate retired from kickboxing because he had already achieved so much in the sports scene and wanted to accomplish other goals, including getting filthy rich. 
So, what is his net worth? In a podcast with Aiden Ross, Andrew Tate claimed he was a trillionaire. When asked what his net worth was, he said, I was broke for a long time. I made my first million when I was 27, and I had 100 million by the time I was 31 or 32, and I became a trillionaire quite recently, he said. However, this claim is far-fetched. Andrew Tate's net worth was estimated to be around 250 million in 2022. Given the aforementioned revenue streams, this figure appears more credible. That's it for today. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe and turn on that notification bell so you never miss out on any future content we'll produce for you guys. We're signing off now, but we'll be sure to catch you all in the next one.